What's up, you two? This is Prince today, TP101, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak 8.1.1 running on all the device that supports 8.1 your iPod, 5G, your iPads, and every, basically every device that supports 8.1.1. So, Taiji just released the jailbreak, guys, and if you haven't updated to 8.1 as, as yet, I would advise you to do so using iTunes, not the over the ear update. And if you did so using the over the ear update, I would advise you to go to iTunes, plug in your phone create a backup then restore your phone back to 8.1.1 and then after you've done that you, you then you could jailbreak but first you want to turn off you find my iPhone and also turn off passcode lock okay. and then you want to go to the website below Taiji website you want to download the tool just click on it it should be in Chinese but my computer translated a little bit click on that after you download it you're gonna get a folder on your desktop just wanna double tap on that and you see the Taiji tool right here. Double tap on that again. It should ask you for permission. I want to give it permission. Then it should open up. There it is right there. Check in for my device. You can see it says iPhone 5S, which is right here. And then you want to make sure CDI is checked. And then you want to uncheck the green one. And then you want to hit X because you don't want all that stuff downloaded to your phone. So after you did, after you uncheck the other one and keep CD unchecked, you want to hit the green button, which is jailbreak. You should see the progress bar right there. And this should be done pretty quick, guys. We're already at 30%. And what I think about this jailbreak, I think they should have waited a little bit because. I, Apple is still signing 8.1.1 um, so if you accidentally update to 8.1.1 which is I don't know how you accidentally update but if you update to 8.1.1 and you want to downgrade back to 8.1 you can still do so so don't check that that's does it done it'll keep my running I think they should have waited not burn a J but I think Taiji and Pangu are in race and a race to see who first could drop the jailbreak so that's what it is but me personally I think they should have waited because you're not completely stuck on 8.1.1 yet so it is what it is though it's always great to get a new jailbreak and you could update to the latest firmware get all the bug fixes and all that so it's kind of a double-edged sword I think but there we go pretty much the jailbreak is done I'm just waiting for my device to boot up and it's only been what, a couple of minutes so this is a real fast jailbreak Phone vibrating. Let's go to iTunes. Slide to unlock. And there's Cydia right there, guys. Cydia on my device. Let's open it up. It's going to prepare a file system. I'll come back when that's done. Okay, guys, so my phone's going to reboot in a minute now. There you go. See they are running on 8.1.1 guys Let's scroll all the way down you can see it iPhone 6 which is the iPhone 5 8.1.1 CD 1.1.16 so there you go guys that's how you jailbreak 8.1.1 it's printed at ATP 101 rate comment and definitely subscribe and check out my channel a whole bunch of tweet videos is there where you could trick out your um, the iPhone with my other with my iPhone 6 set. This is my iPhone 6 right here. And you can see that that thing is tricked out. So if you want to hook up your phone like that, then definitely check out my channel. Peace. Thanks for watching.